Hello and welcome to the sixth drill. Uh, we have to write a function that will take a two string, two word string, and it will return true if both words begin with the same letter. For example, here it's two string. Uh, so it, uh, both the words uh, start with the same letter, so it should return true. If it's not, if it's two string, then it should return false. So let's start. We have to write a function. So it will call my string and take it as an input. And then we have to uh, split the string so that it can actually store, uh, uh, store the two words that it contains. Now it's split and we have to return the, we can use the double indexing technique. We just have to, uh, we don't have to go through all the letters in the word. We just have to check the first letter. So we're using double indexing. So if test zero of zero, is equal to test one of zero. That means if the first index of the first letter is the same as the first index of the second letter, then we will return true. Otherwise it will be false. So let's see if it works. Um, test suppose we have to use the split attribute. We have to use the split as attribute in the my string. And then uh, you can see that it's returning false because it starts with two different letters. Let's try if it starts with two same letters, then it's returning true. So that's how we can check uh, if a two word string uh, contains uh, the same letter in both words.